Hey and welcome back to Through the Years, the series in which we take a look at the month's chosen pay-per-view, pick out a few of our favourite matches to ever take place at that pay-per-view and simulate them in the WWE 2K series. This weekend's pay-per-view is of course Extreme Rules, originally established back in 2009 with a total of 9 women's matches taking place so far. In this edition of Extreme Rules Through the Years, we take a look back to 2010 where Michelle McCool defended her Women's Championship against Beth Phoenix in an Extreme Makeover match. If you're enjoying the series, please leave a like below and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Also, let us know in the comments below which is your favourite match to ever take place at this month's chosen pay per and enjoy the video. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Women's Championship. A huge title defense here for the women's champion, guys. And believe it or not, I'm told the champ comes into this title defense more confident than she's ever been in the past. Well, she certainly has her work cut out for her. And Byron, tell me, what do you think of her chances here tonight? Well, given how dominant the champs looked as of late, I have to say that I'm not wild about her chances here tonight. But hey, crazier things have happened. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. And a lot of people look at her as one of the most dominant women of her generation. Would you agree with that assessment, Byron? Oh, absolutely. But if she wants to be considered the most dominant woman of this generation, she's going to have to string together several more successful title defenses, starting with this one here tonight. Where's this going? Wait a minute. We need to get some order back to this. This is the champion's advantage at play, Cole. Here we go, folks. It's go time. Well, she's in there with one of the best. One wrong move, and she'll find herself a former champion in no time. I know these superstars are excited to compete here in the same city where superstar Billy Graham defeated Bruno San Martino for the WWE Championship back in 1977. McKay is an interesting subject to say the least. For those that haven't seen her, tell us what she has to do to win this one. Well, this is not gonna be a walk in the park tonight. Not when you're in the ring with somebody so skilled. One thing I can say about her is if she does get beat, it won't be because of a lack of preparation or effort. Beth Phoenix got her there. Watch out. There's the drop kick. Connects with the championship. Oh, man, that one landed square, too. Hits her with a clothesline from seemingly out of nowhere. She's taking a while to get up here. I was just thinking the same thing, Michael. Beth Phoenix got her there. That one misses big time. Better luck next time. Beth Phoenix makes her pay there. She's not playing any games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me! Uh. 
Perhaps a power bomb here, Corey. That certainly seems to be the case. Oh no, we could be looking at a power bomb. I think you're right. Corey. Here it is. Oh my goodness. Oh man, hoping to end it early. There's an ear fall. Clearly not enough damage done. We're looking at she reverses out of it. And not a second too soon. Close call there. She might have it. Oh, Beth Phoenix brings the pain. She's in firm control of this one. That is exactly what Beth Phoenix needed. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Slams her face down. Here we go, back inside the ring. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know, never say never, Cole. Beth Phoenix got her there. These superstars look determined to destroy each other here tonight, which is what you would expect, I guess, when the gold is on the line. Beth Phoenix making her move. Wow, and Beth Phoenix has the WW Universe on its feet. There it is. But now, can Beth Phoenix hope to end it here? One, two, three. We have a new champion. You know, it didn't happen often, but I can attest, being pinned is humiliating. And that's yet another great match the city of Baltimore has hosted over the years. 